year, an unbroken chain of Harley Davidsons thundered westward from Grand Prairie on Alaska Highway, led by actor Dan Aykroyd in support of the grand opening of Canada's newest museum, the Philip J. Curry Dinosaur Museum. A year has rolled by since, and what an incredible year for our community that we are gathered here to celebrate. The museum is located within minutes from the world's densest dinosaur bone beds, potentially a world heritage site. My name is Philip J. Curry and um, I feel very good about how things have progressed uh, both with the museum and all the programs associated with the museum. I'm Corwin Sullivan from the Institute of Vertebrate Paleontology and Paleoanthropology or the IVPP in Beijing. Nick Campioni, a Canadian but um, now based in Uppsala in Sweden. This is uh, Cameron Reed, who's a summer student at the museum. My colleague Xu Xing uh, from the IVPP. It's uh, nice to see that the museum's had a successful first year and I'm sure it will continue to have many more. This museum is one of the most interactive uh, in all of Canada, if not the world. If you consider that curiosity at, is at the root of all education and at the root of all museums, then I think that we've really struck a gold medal here in terms of education and what that means for the youth of our future. hundred thousand plus people through the doors. Who would have thought a year ago that this would have happened? You know, it's been such a wonderful collaboration and, and uh, partnership both with the town of Wembley, the region, the museum, and the society. We look forward to the future. It's nothing but bright. On September 2015, we delivered the fastest museum project in Canadian history. This year, we celebrate hard-earned awards, accolades, and record-breaking attendance that has impacted over 67,000 school children and brought in 120,000 through our doors. possibilities and potential of this museum are limited only by our imagination. This is your museum. Nurture it and serve our communities well. The journey has just begun.